And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can fix broken character models from things like Mixamo, Asset Store, or anywhere else. Don't forget, click the subscribe button and click the bell icon as well. Stay up to date with every video I upload to this channel. With that in mind, let's get fixing. So a common problem I've seen people come across, um, more so lately, I'm not quite sure why, is when they bring models in, this one that I have right here is actually from Mixamo, but it does apply to the Asset Store and wherever else as well every now and again. Uh, you'll notice that it doesn't quite look like how it's supposed to. And if you pan around the actual model itself, you'll see that things kind of change. So it's as though something isn't right. And this is our first clue as to what is wrong. Looks like something from uh, Assassin's Creed Unity, if I'm honest. Anyway, that aside, the actual problem with it is the material rather than the model itself. So yes, that is creepy and insane in its own right. But to fix it, we go to wherever your model is, the prefab. So down here, I've got this here and we're going to edit the material. That is what's doing it. In most cases, in a prefab, in this instance, it will be blocked out, as we can see, because it comes part of the prefab. To get around that, if you hold Control and press D on that material and extract it, you'll be able to then edit it. Now, obviously, different shaders have different combinations. Of the, you know, shaders are quite complex things. But by default, the standard shader, the rendering mode, should actually be opaque. So... If you have that problem where it looks like this, the character just doesn't seem right, try changing that rendering mode from transparent or whatever it may be to opaque. Once you have that sorted, go to wherever your model is. For example, here, this one, you can see that the material is this one right here. All we need to do is replace that material that is within the prefab with the one we have modified. So in this case, drag and drop that material onto there and you now have your fixed model. Most of the time that will be the case. Um, it is basically down to the way the shader has been set up, especially if you're using the standard shader. But don't forget, you can always change the shader if you see fit. You don't necessarily have to keep it as um, the standard. It's entirely up to you. But yeah, if you have that problem, that will be how you fix this particular problem. And like I say, shading, change anything, that's kind of cool. But most of the time, that will be your problem. Just change it back to opaque rather than transparent. Guys, I hope that's helped and I hope it's useful to some of you. If you have any more problems with anything like this, leave a comment below and I will do my best to get back to you. And if not, there are many people in this community who are more than willing to help out. Guys, thank you very much for watching.